Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of OMSI 2. Today we're back down in West Country and we're going to be having another drive on the Route 122 which runs from Paynton Memorial Crescent, which is where we are now. Oh look, another one. Um, yeah, Paynton Memorial Crescent right the way through to Stoneley. It's a seasider route, hence why we've got the nice open top and Gemini 3 today. I'm assuming, because I've just, uh, just started the route, that, uh, that we've actually replaced this one here. It's nice that they're both in the same livery, isn't it? They, they do really look quite good together. In fact, should we take a screenshot? Nah, we don't want the London City bus in there. Nah, it'll be fine. Let's get it fired up, because we've not actually got that long to go. I don't think we've got 1.8 minutes flipping heck. Right, okay. Let's just uh, let's just nip up here. Bit of lighting on. Have we got lighting upstairs? Whoop, where are we? I think, do, do they have lighting upstairs? Uh. What's that do? Yeah, lighting upstairs is on. That is excellent. Brilliant. Okay, we'll uh, we'll have a little bit of lighting on down here as well. Yeah, there we go. Oh, the air's building up. That's good. We'll pop our ticket uh, machine ID in. Driver login. Yeah, lovely. Three nine two two. Brilliant. So we're going to be selling tickets on this. Uh, brilliant bus to drive this. I really do enjoy it, hence why I picked it. Uh, I would advise that you go and check this one out. It's on the Steam Store, and there's a link in the description where you can get that. We'll see if... Uh, oh, no, not 12. Hang on. How do you do it now on this? You have to put a number in, don't you? I'm not convinced that this works how it should. Uh, paint them to Stonely, 90. I don't think that the Hanovers work like this. Uh, but I'm happy to be proved wrong. There we go. 90. Brilliant. Right, okay. I know it's beeping, but we'll, we'll just pull down so we can start boarding passengers. Heck, there's a few getting on, isn't there? Right down to the end is, uh, is where we need to be. Look at that. Right, okie dokie. Yeah, opening the doors and putting the handbrake on what? us. Just dipped our oh, air below uh, the, uh, the, where it needs to be. 30, right, 5, 7, 8, 50, 70. Lovely. I do like, uh, unlike yeah. the bailing, rider, please. that this has actually got, uh, it's got a two-pound coin and Lovely. all the notes, so you know, you've got everything that you need, you don't have people whinging at you. I wish you'd had a two-pound coin to the bailing. Oh, it is the bailing I'm thinking of, isn't it? Uh, right. Excuse me, Doc. I think so, I can't Maybe remember. Maybe return, please. Good lord. Lovely. Cheers. Paying for a two pound return with a twenty pound note. Good lord. That's ridiculous. Right, okay. You're more like it. Exact change. Hey, Thank you. Hi. I'm a little bit disappointed we don't have an assault screen, but then again I guess this is an open top bus, so you're not really expecting a lot of uh, antisocial behaviour, are you? Right, five, seven, eight, fifty, seventy, ninety. Lovely. Can I have a child hey, return, please? Uh, yeah, lovely. Thank you. Thank you, child. Go and sit down. Oh, God, twenty pound note, you're having a laugh. 185070, thank you. Thank you. Hello, oh, yeah. Can I have a single, please? Yes, you can. 578570, lovely, thank you. Oh, uh, single, please. Hello. Brilliant, there we go. Christ, how many have we got? We've got a lot boarding, haven't we? 5070, thank you, thank you. Right, off we go. We're a little bit late. 0 0.9 minutes late. Goodness me, right, okay. Let's, uh, we've got nobody coming. Brilliant. It's actually a while since we've driven the Master uh, the Master Switch Gemini 3, isn't it? This is, of course, the Gemini 3. When you buy this, you get quite a lot of different specs. Uh, as uh, any Master Switch bus, you do get a lot of different specs. Uh, street decks, uh, the Master Switch Master Deck, is it? Is it the Master Deck? This is obviously the Gemini 3 or the Gen 3. Uh, so you've got them on the Volvo chassis or on the Wright Bus Integral chassis. Plenty of, uh, of value for money there when buying uh, this product. Like I say, I, I mean, most people that play OMSI will have Hello, this bus mate. anyway, I'd imagine. Hello. I mean, it's it's one of those. It's uh, been out for so long, and it's just a staple. I, I don't think anybody's OMSI collection is <laughs> complete without this bus. Uh, 50, 70. Yeah. All right, but yeah, if you haven't bought it yet, there is still a link in the description on where you can check it out. I do recommend it, like I say. Uh, right. Lovely. Right, off we go. Still not sussed out what that that little, like, can you hear it? It goes like da 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 da. It's like a little sound when you're accelerating. I've I've still not quite figured out what it's meant to be. That one, hear it? 
I don't know if it's like meant to be a rattle sound or if... Yeah, I'm, I'm not entirely sure. Right, here we go. Pull in. I think this open top version was added as a uh, as an update, hey, wasn't it, later know, on? Right, mate, I don't think we had this from day one when this was released. Thank you very much. Keep Hello on. there. 70, you, lovely. Um, a deer rider, please. Thanks very much. That sounds like a bus going the other way, doesn't it? A London city bus. Oh, it's it's overtaking us, good lord. Right, are you, you're not letting us out, are you? You are. Bit of lag. There we go. Let's see. If I pause that there, are we going to get a nice shot? Oh, we might do actually. It's not. It's not the best, is it? But it's quite a nice. You know, the sun's going down. Lovely. We'll we'll keep that just in case. You never know when you might need another screenshot. I always like to take a few just to see what we're using as the cover photo. Yeah, still a minute late, not made up any time, but I mean, this is a seaside open top service, isn't it? So, you wouldn't imagine that we're having to floor it down here. Although we are sort of having to floor it down here to make up the time. You'd imagine this would have been a bit more of a leisurely timetable, wouldn't you? I do like as well on West Country how we've got, like, this is the 111 in front here. It's just off to the right. It's got, you know, routes that aren't featured. It's nice to have the AI buses on. What are we not going to forget? You're not on a Route 12, Joe, so you're not going to go down. Uh, you're not going to go down the dual carriageway because I am an absolute bugger on this for uh, for going straight down the bypass, completely missing out the little caravan park. Because obviously this oh, one two two goes around the caravan that. park, doesn't it? Right, hang on. Yep, there Thank we go. The day much. ticket has been completed. Oh, I'm sorry, love. You've missed your stop. You need to be quicker than that. Is this a recent OMSI thing? I don't, I don't think they're still updating it, are they? But yeah, it seems to be taking passengers a lot longer to get off the double-deckers. Is it because there's just one door? Like, usually they're all waiting, aren't they, down at the front? But yeah, we were having this on the uh, on the Enviro 400, the Studio Polygon 400 MMC, weren't we? Okay. Whether we're just taking forever to get off. Return, yeah. But I always think, Can if I I'd I managed to sell all these tickets, uh, yeah, 50, 70, 90. If I've managed to sell all these please. tickets and board all these passengers and they've still not got off yet, then uh, I think it's their problem, not mine. You can child. That's the first child single I've sold all video. Lovely. I don't think we're going to get out there, so let's not try it after this one. Lovely. There we go. We'll make a bit of time up now. Full steam ahead. Yeah, it's, uh, is it limited to 37? I think it is. I'm sure I read somewhere or I was told, I'm pretty sure I was told, that the uh, the Diamond Bus street decks could only do 37 miles an hour. The one that they've got in Manchester, they could only they could only do 37, but they were like little rocket ships when we went on them. Yes, I was told they were limited to 37, 47, no, it would be 37, wouldn't it? Because that's, like most buses, are limited to around 47 to 52 miles an hour, aren't they? Uh, but yeah, about 37 mile an hour, because I thought that they'd be really, really slow. You know, street decks, brand new, environmentally friendly bus, chronically slow. People walking on the beach on the left, hello! Um, yeah, I thought they'd be chronically slow, but they weren't. They were actually quite nippy. But obviously then they uh, they max out. Let's remember to go down here. Lovely. Get that off. Have a little plod. 
This is Ferncombe Sands, where at night time the 122 terminates, doesn't it? It's only a little short route on a night. Hello, mate. Single. Hey, driver. Uh, hang on. Yeah, there we go. Lovely. Eight seventy. Cheers. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah. It's four thirty five fifty seventy. Thank you very much. Hello. Hello. We're getting a little bit too good at this ticket selling, which means disaster can only be around much. the corner. A child return, please. Yep. There we go. Thank you. Right, off we go. Full steam ahead. Oh, hang on. Everyone's waiting for me anyway. Cheers for that, everybody. This is a bit where they usually complain at me. I'm surprised they haven't yet. It's a really nice time of day to drive, isn't it? Where the sun's just setting, you know, there's that lovely orangey, yellowy... Oh, hang on, sorry. Yeah, we've committed. Sorry, Mr. Focus Driver. I'm going to pretend for my own sanity that he let us out there. Yeah, sounds better, doesn't it? You just didn't see him flash. I, I knew that he was going to let us out, because, you know, reasons... Oh, we're going to clip the curb. Oh no, we just managed to avoid it. Lovely. Nobody getting off here, that's fine. That's unusual, we usually stop there, don't we? Oh, either they wanted that stop and they pressed the bell too late, or we were just a little bit early for uh, for the next one, weren't they? Could have slammed on and sent them flying, but you know. Why are you indicating left? What an awful coloured BMW. Why would you buy a lovely car like that? Is it a 3 series estate? A 5 series estate? Yes, I'd like it uh, I'd like it in that awful shade of green. I'm not going to say what it reminds me of. That's something you'd find at a baby's nappy. I'm not going to say what it reminds me of and then proceeds to say what it reminds you of. Great one! Yeah, good! It is a great little route, this, isn't it? It's a nice little hop, because I think the uh, the 35 can be a little bit long. Is it, what, 40 minutes? Is it half an hour or 40 minutes uh, in length, the, uh, the 35? I think it depends whether you're going to the trade estate or just Totnes Town Centre, doesn't it? But, uh, yeah, it's quite a lengthy route. The 12's all right, that's about half an hour, but this is just a nice little hop. You know, if you if you just want to do a little trip up to, uh, to Stoneley and back, and my favourite bit of this map is easily the bit round Stoneley. I think it's so nice. Such a lovely bit of map to drive in, isn't it? I am hoping that with the new updates to West Country, uh, as and when we see them, Hello, mate. that we have a couple Hello, more like, quite narrow roads, you know, that are just a little bit country-esque. Lovely. A little Cheers. bit windy. Can, That's why I like the 35. Yeah, I think there's quite a lot of maps where it's the, the wide roads, there's a lot of fast running. I think West Country is not like that. I think we should have like little country villages that you can go around in your little bus. It'd be a perfect, uh, I mean, that new map that's coming. New map? New route that's coming. The Totnes Town Circular. I think that's ideal for the Digibus Mirage, isn't it? The uh, the Optair Solo. I have a little soft spot for that bus. I know that it's not the best. It's probably not the best value for money either, but I, I do have a soft spot for that. Maybe it's because I learnt to drive buses in the Anoptair Solo. Oh, it was hideous to drive. Hello there. 
one return there, please. Well, I say it was hideous to drive. At the time, I didn't actually know any much. different because it was the first bus that, I had ever, uh, that I'd ever driven. But compared to other buses that I've driven, the Renown, the Eclipse, uh, Dennis Darts, etc., the Opte Solo that I learned in Christ Alive, it was, it was terrible. I mean, I always liked a Solo, but yeah, it wasn't a good one to drive. I don't know if all Solos are terrible to drive or if that was just a bad example of one, but yeah, goodness me. I don't believe they even use that anymore. I don't think they use it to train people. I think it's uh, a Sunsun Diggy Volvo B9, B11. It's a Volvo B something or other. Sunsun Diggy Sidoral, I think they're called. Hello. 10 out of 10 for pronunciation as ever. Thank you, driver. How were we still a minute late? Right, we're going to put our foot down here to build up as much speed as we can in the hope that we'll make it up this hill. This is not the fastest bus in the world. The uh, the Eclipse, the Eclipse 2, the Veiling, is certainly a lot quicker on the old hills than uh, than this. Yep, there we go. We're, we're losing it. We're losing it. What I do like, however, is that you see, that still sits a little bit high, doesn't it, on the wheel, but the veil in it sits too high, doesn't it? I'm really surprised they've not fixed that yet. Unless it's meant to be there, you know, and I just have absolutely no taste. I'm not sure. Come on, there we go, we've got the speed back. Yeah, we can't do 40 anyway, can we even foot down? I'm, I'm assuming that this is a set there, because I'm pretty sure that we've... way Always gets me that bit. <laughs> I'm assuming, yeah, it must be a set there, because we've gone quicker than 37 miles an hour, haven't we? Yeah, it must be 60 kilometres an hour that it's limited to. But I guess it's a seaside bus, isn't it? So when would you ever be going faster than that? When you're on the downhill, like we are now. Mmm. Spicy. Very spicy. Right, we're off to the left here, aren't we? Down in Stonely. You can tell how many times I've driven this map. A lot of times, actually. I can't believe that this version of West Country came out two years ago. I remember when it was brand new. Since then, we've seen the Valen, we've seen the, uh, we've seen the Renown, haven't we? We've seen so many buses. I think the Studio Polygon MMC was out before this, wasn't it? I'm pretty sure it was, yeah. Man, she was it? I can't remember. It's been that long. There's been that many releases, haven't there, Fromzy? Obviously, the Digibus Mirage, the Optus Solo's been out. A little bit of lag coming down into Stonely there. I do love that Volvo indicator. It sounds fantastic, doesn't it? I still think I'm more of a ping, ping, ping man that I've got on uh, that I've got on my B7, the older uh, style that you find on ALX 400s. But it's still a it's still a nice indicator, isn't it? Right, let's see. We'll, uh, we'll get round before this post van. Wasn't a Royal Mail van, was it? I thought that it would be, but there we go. It really is a lovely time of night. Not even night, a lovely time of evening. Look at that, it's just a nice bit of map, isn't it? This bit all the way to the end of the map is just my favourite. You know, the nice, kind of narrow, windy roads. Slow driving, I quite like that on Omsi. You know, not racing round, just pottering round, little tight roads. This is what makes West Country for me. Got someone to get off yet? Yeah, lovely. And quite a few to get off actually. Come on then, off you pop. Oh, sorry, sir. You fall asleep upstairs or what? How on earth could you fall up uh, fall asleep upstairs? I'm gonna say, how could you fall upstairs? 
That's that's not what happened. How could you fall asleep upstairs? The amount of wind, surely you must be able to uh, must be able to stay awake with the amount of racket that must be up there. There we go, all the way round. Stonely bus terminus. It's just lovely, isn't it? I'm going to keep saying that because it just is. It's a really nice, really nice map. This. So much thought and detail gone into it. Iomex and uh, the people at UK DT really should be very proud of themselves for this map. Right, well, there we go. That is where the Route 122 terminates. You know that, though. We've driven this before together. Uh, thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. It's a gorgeous bus, gorgeous route. And, uh, yeah, if you want to go check that out, the livery and the bus. I never said the livery before, did I? But the livery, uh, the link to the livery and the bus itself are in the description. If you've enjoyed the video today, please do show your appreciation for... Uh, the video by clicking the like button it's always appreciated and if you haven't already do consider subscribing There's lot, still lots of exciting things coming out for Omzi this year and I'd absolutely hate for you to miss it so do consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any future Omzi awesomeness it's a bit Virgin Trains isn't it arrive awesome anyway get inside tracked yes thank you so so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you all next time cheerio goodbye for now